Investing in yourself is one of the best things you can do in life. Now, typically when we hear about investing, it's typically about you know investing your finances in the stock market or different assets that can provide for a secure financial future and uh, a secure retirement. But investments aren't just limited to finances. I think one of the things that the people often don't think about is and it, what something that is so important in life is investing in yourself. And over time, you need to do that continuously throughout your life because that when you do that, it improves your your chances, your success, your financial prosperity in life. And what I mean by investing in yourself is a couple different things. One, you can you can invest in yourself. It doesn't cost you anything as long as you put time into something. It can be free. You just need to spend your time learning. And you can invest in yourself in your future by reading books, by listening to podcasts, by watching videos on YouTube that help you learn about different topics, whether it's investing or personal growth, whatever it is, if you want to learn a new skill. Every time you, you watch a video, listen to a podcast, read a book by somebody else who has uh, done something, achieve something that, that you want to achieve, you are investing in yourself because the more you know, uh, the more you are going to be capable of achieving that thing. Or, you know, for example, if you want to start a business and you don't know how to do it, you can read books, read articles, listen to podcasts on how to do it. By doing that, you are investing in yourself and you are helping yourself, your future self to actually start that business. Uh, super critical. The learning, the continuous learning through life is a really big aspect of investing in yourself and that's really important to pay attention to. Uh, another way of investing in yourself is the basics that you are required to have for any kind of job that you either currently have or that you want to have. And an example of this is if you have the opportunity to take a job that you want that maybe pays more than what you are making right now, and that job requ requires that you dig holes or ditches you know, in the dirt and you don't have a pair of shoes that allow you to do that, going out and buying a pair of shoes that can allow you to take that job and do that job and get paid for it is an investment in yourself. So buying a pair of shoes, work shoes that allows you to do that is an investment in yourself. Likewise, if you wanna go into the trades, like you wanna become an electrician or a plumber, go out there on your own, buying the tools and the supplies that you need to actually operate that business is an investment in yourself. Now, like life, like, like you have in financial investments, there's no guarantee of success in anything that you do. If you go out and start your own business, there's no guarantee of success. It's a risky, risky thing. There are risks everywhere in life. But if, if you need to, to acquire something in order to get a better paying job, or you want to start something new and you need software, you need tools, you need skills, whatever it is you need, it, it, buying those things, purchasing those things, spending some of your time and money to better yourself is so critical for the future. Other things that you can do to help improve yourself and invest in yourself are things like attend conferences and seminars and online courses. Those things also increase your knowledge, your experience, your skill set. So always remember that. Always invest in yourself throughout life, no matter you know, if you're already investing financially, that's fantastic. You need to do that, but you also need to invest in yourself. So super critical to do. I hope you guys found that useful. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Um, if you aren't already a subscriber on my YouTube channel, definitely subscribe there. That's where I put all my videos on personal growth, investing, and other topics. And when you do subscribe, make sure to click the notification bell so you get notified whenever I release a new video. Again, I love it when you guys uh, share my content, when you give a thumbs up and you like the, the video, like the page. Really appreciate it. It gives me motivation to keep creating these things. So anyway, I really appreciate that. And until I see you guys next time, I wish you all the best of luck in all your endeavors. Until later, take care. Good luck. God bless.